Hello everyone, Sigmalator here. Welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda. I have some emails to read. And it turns out that mission was not the point of no return as I feared. And I've also looked up some of the tasks, like the Roker Manifestos. I can still do them. It, it, it is literally just a case of uh, looking. So we're going to get all of that sorted. Grab all these. I have this to spend. Versatility. Yeah, let's boost that. There we go. Straight teams, how, you, how, how have you guys done? Successful, good. Successful, good. And successful. Okay, it's not getting the thing saying that that's done. All right, let's send them out. And the strike team. Ooh, early 80. Ooh, that, ooh, that's low. We'll send them regardless. What about you? God, these are... Let's claim all of those. Ah, uh, I have 95 mission funds. Okay. I need to remember that I can recruit more teams. Alright. So I will be going through the task. It's just going to... I hope the Salarians find their place on the Nexus. A lot of your people were lost. We came to Andromeda because we had a contribution to make. The cat won't take that away. How are you doing, Kalo? Let's better talk to you first. A real victory. Our Ark back at the Nexus. I'd almost given up hope. The Kett won't touch the Parchero again. The militia will see to that. Losing Pathfinder Rekha is a blow. So many Salarians joined the initiative because of her. But you did your best. Did you need me? Yeah, I think we're good. I'll let you concentrate. You know where I'll be. You're all right, Callow. I need a break. Do you need a break? Let's go for a break. I feel like I was supposed supposed to read your email first. Care for some tea, Ryder? I'd love a cup. It's a cultivar originating in Sumatra. My own personal stash. Once I run out, that'll be it for Earth Tea. I keep having these thoughts. I'm never going to taste this again. Never gonna see that again. You're not the only one, Suvi. I have those senseless thoughts all the damn time. And? Do they bother you? It's natural. You'd have to be made of stone not to miss home sometimes. The universe is like a giant tapestry. I love following its threads. But it distracts me from the whole picture. My family was right there. But I was too occupied by the abstract to appreciate them. From everything you've told me, you're here because of your family. Your love of science, doesn't that come from them? Aren't you with them every time you chase down a new discovery? Ryder, that's beautiful. My mother made the implant in my head, and my father created the AI that uses it. I haven't lost them either. Thank you, Ryder. You're welcome, CV. Now oh, we're back in my, we're in my place. Uh, meet my true mother. Uh, from Jal, Ryder, I've been telling my family about you and my time on the Tempest. I'd love uh, for you to meet them and see where I grew up. My true mother, uh, Sahuna, is especially interested in meeting you. Next time we're on Haval, let's stop by. Well, we're going to have to go back there anyway to finish those tasks. Uh, from Kesh, Ryder, I'm worried about my grandfather. He likes to act tough, but he's still an old man and he's been through a lot. We just took just talked. He said he's fine, but I could tell he's hurting. After I nagged too much, he promised to go see your ship's doctor. Can you do me a favour and make sure he does? I need him alive a little longer, please. Sure, we can do that for you, Cash. 
Right, I thought about our talk after the uh, Luc Lucinia gets got some inspiration. Come and chat next time we're both on the ship. Can do. Uh, from Gil, hey, next time we're on EOS, I'm meeting up with my buddy Jill. She'd love to meet you, and I kind of said you'd make an appearance. So don't make me, don't make a liar out of me. God damn it, Gil. Yeah, sure, we can do that. From Nackmore Clan Pathfinder. Nackmore Scouts recently returned with a troubling report. Two Ket ships crashed on a plateau on Elodin after taking damage flying through the Scourge. One scout swears she saw one of the ships firing upon the other as, as they went down, but we were unable to verify this claim. If there are survivors from this crash, the desert will quickly claim their lives. However, we believe the circumstances surrounding the crash are unusual, uh, un unusual enough to warrant bringing to the attention of the Pathfinder. Like more clan of New Tshunka. Yep, yeah, we can check that out. Uh, from the Moshai. If you intend to fight the Ket, you should understand the enemy as we do. There are still a few of us who remember what it was like when the Ket first came and how our lives changed once we discovered their true intentions. Learn what our elders have to teach you. I'm, uh, I'm told, I've told them you're coming and given you the means of finding them on Aya. With respect, the Moshai. Uh, Kerry's in trouble. Ryder, I'm Kerry's producer for the docu uh, documentary. Something's happened. Come by when you're on the Nexus. Next, we should talk. Right. Reports from the Archon's flagship sounded pretty harsh. Hope you're doing okay. Something that gets me. When I can stop thinking about what happened to the Salones and the Krogan is all those remnant artifacts the Archon had. This isn't just a mission for him, it's an obsession. I've fought people like that before who only have one thought in their head that burns everything else away. They get very dangerous very fast, watching your back, Cora. One more try. Then Gara have a bar where PB got tipsy. He's a flirt, even alert, but saw she's a pixie. <laughs> <laughs> 60 hours straight keeping your ship afloat does it show I like that I like that Gil just putting this out there I had a friend in Hustle Dondi we were clearing a hospital after an earthquake and she got hit with a chunk of uh, rebar split her helmet kept going 4 minutes technically dead but we got her into emergency stasis thing is because they're so good at patching people up she was back uh, back with us in a week and she uh, shouldn't have been sure Dondi's a vet she seems some shit but you don't walk that off she uh, worked that quake site for a week then disappeared for five months she came back but different the other vets they knew take the time if you need it you don't die and just shake it off and cost her that's a good point and go on guns man Roger I thought I knew guns but this and go and shit they really know how to take things to point how to make things to point and shoot was eyeing a, a, a couple on Aya when we were there. A sidearm called a cipher and a sniper rifle, Ishari. I think they called it. Looked fancy, but I guess even their shivs are fancy. Glad we found aliens to know how to fight. Not sure how I would feel if Andromeda was nothing but Pie Jacks or uh, Elcor. I'll take care over those chumps. <laughs> Uh, I'm encouraging all crew members to take up stress-relieving hobbies. Everyone, especially you, is under a lot of pressure. While taking up knitting may seem a waste of time, such activities release endorphins that clear clutter from our brains so we can solve tough problems and make better decisions. You don't have to choose any of the activities below, but I thought they might jog some ideas. Whoops. Uh, gardening, reading, knitting, crocheting, colouring or painting, uh, journaling. I'm always here if you uh, need to talk, Lexi. I'm writing to let you know that I've been receiving a lot of messages of congratulations from the Resistance members who've heard of our victory against the Archon. It's not common knowledge, but it's hard to keep good news like this from spreading. We are a hopeful people who are granted new hope. Imagine the excitement when we con conquer Meridian and heal the cluster for all our people. Some nights I can't sleep because I'm dreaming of it. Uh, Liam's talking about a movie night, but when he explained it sounded lacking, at least compared to Angaran vids. Perhaps I can add what's missing. Come talk to me. All right. Let's go. Let's go catch up with the crew. It's. Uh. 
Move your arm again. Readings won't change, Doc. Your prosthetics are sinking properly. Your neuropathy-induced pain levels are... consistent. Hey, I'm used to it. It's okay. No, it's not okay. You keep fighting smart, you hear me? You don't have much left in terms of organ redundancies. Uh, <clears throat> nah, it's fine. I don't mind. Everything okay? This looks... like a lot. It is a lot. Just nothing he didn't already know about. What do you mean? He's fine, just... old. And missing too many parts. And too stubborn for his own good. You love me just the way I am, Doc. Hmm. Don't get off that table until the scan is done. Can I ask <laughs> what happened? Arm, side, hip, part of my leg. Strain balancing threading across my spine. It's all prosthetics and implants. That's... A lot. Made it through the Krogan rebellions. Watched my culture disintegrate. Survived centuries as a merc. And all sorts of pirate shenanigans. A thousand years of combat experience. All it took was one idiot with a pack of frag grenades. It must have been hard. Yeah, it got pretty bad. I hit some dark moments. Implant rejection after implant rejection. Prosthetics not sinking properly. Everything hurt. A lot. All the time. No purpose to anything. How did you deal with it? I didn't. I fell right into that pit. Almost. But then some shaman shows up, drops the tiniest little baby girl in my lap. This one's dying, he said. Not worth the trouble, he says. Useless is what he meant. That's awful. It's practical, Krogan. Gave me a purpose again. Wasn't just about me anymore, so I got help. Learned how to take care of myself, take care of her, and she took care of me. You found a way to live again. We sure did. Wasn't easy on either of us. I'm old, stuck in my ways, and Cash... Cash has wanted to change everything since she could talk. Raising Cash taught me an important lesson. And you're going to tell me all about it, aren't you? Damn right I am. Parents aren't meant to be a goal. Or a finish line. We're the starting line. Where you go from there, it's all you. Remember that. Check the Tempest Mid Bay. Done that. Feeling okay? All right, nothing. Okay. Get back to it. I'll be here if you need me. All right, let's go talk to. Who's in here? Oh, Jarl and Gill are here. I suppose we need to talk. Do we need to talk to them? Hey, you're two for two. What do you mean? 
Two times face to face with the Archon. Two times you spit in said face. Figuratively speaking, of course. We were nose to nose this time. Some spit might have hit the mark. That's a two-way street, Ryder. Ugh. Bastards trying to exalt us all, huh? That's what all this is about. Could be. Typically, I like high-stakes games, but I'd rather be sitting at the kiddie table this time. Good talking to you, Gil. Anytime. <clears throat> Liam's idea about watching vids together. Movie night? He delayed again, out of respect for Reka. Hmm. Good. From what I've seen, your vids are flat. They're only seen and heard. Angara vids use uh, tiny electrodermal signals. You feel it through your skin. I spoke to Gil. We have time to rig up a system to mimic it. If we can acquire the right components. That sounds amazing. Let's do it. Uh, the components we need should be sold on IR. Hmm. Let's be vigilant. Sounds fun. Like a 4D experience. I can get behind that idea. Uh, Cora, we're in here. Or oh, you should be. Where are you? Oh, okay, Cora's downstairs. Interesting. Speak to the leaders on the Nexus. Not going to do that just yet. Right, Cora should be in here. There she is. Got a minute? I could use a favor. Sure. What do you need? I kept thinking about Sarissa and my not being a pathfinder and the thinking turned into a project on eos can you help me finish it what kind of project i'll put the nav points in the helm come along and i'll show you all right sounds good all right we've got plenty to do Right, that's all of the arcs now found. And we've got new places to explore as well. Excellent. Ooh, up here too. Alright, let's head to Aya. getting some of these side quests out of the way. And we, uh, yeah, we've got a couple of things to do here. Things for the movie night and the witnesses. Okay. Uh, I've got a few people to talk to. All right. Wait, 
Where can I fast travel? Game. All right, here we go. The Moshai said you remember when the Ket arrived. My father's oldest friend was chosen to be Volt's ambassador to the Ket. The day he left, they embraced as brothers. All the Ket sent back was his badge and a hollow recording I wasn't allowed to watch. I was too young to understand why everyone was scared, why my father mourned for months. I can imagine how terrifying that was for a child. What frightened me was seeing how helpless my parents felt. All our leaders were confused and fearful. The terror made us hesitate. That's when the cat struck. They'll try the same with you. Be ready. Oh, I will. Ah, it was you, okay. Right, then we go this way, talk to you. Hello. Once I said you'd want to hear my experience with the cat, to learn from it. I do. Tell me about it. They had just arrived. I was on a civilian shuttle to vote when we received a message. The spaceport was on lockdown. Security concerns due to the cat. We were supposed to land on a nearby moon and wait for the all clear. Instead of landing, the shuttle captain turned back. Something felt wrong, he said. Later, we learned it was a cat transmission to isolate us for capture. The captain had saved our lives. You can't have been more than a child when that happened. I was old enough to know life would never be the same. Damn. All right, and the last one. Oh, you're still here, the Moody Salarian. Hello. The Moshai said we should speak. You remember the cat's arrival. One of them came to our city on a vow to offer lavish gifts. We lined up along the street to watch the alien walk with our ambassador. As it passed, it stopped and knelt in front of me. I still dream of what it said. Young one, you are meant for greatness. Now I know why my arrival had everyone on edge. When I saw you walk with Paran through our city, I hoped the guards would kill you. I will never trust outsiders again. I mean, that's fair enough. All right. And, ah, uh, no wonder I missed it. Yeah, the uh, the markers for the missions should probably be emphasised better. It's quite easy to miss them when they're like that. Hello. We are still good. Uh, okay. Remnant decryption key. I don't know if I'm going to need one, but I'll take it. Ooh, element zero. Yeah, I'll have that. Platinum, I'll have that. Okay. Remnant fighter model, yes, I'll have that, thank you. Do you have any copper? You do have copper. I'll have that. And there's something very specific. Vid components, there we go. And I'll sell my salvage. Perfect. All 
Okay, I think we're done here again. Double check, yep. Oh, that was nice and easy. I like it when things are simple. I'm gonna, I'm gonna focus on the side missions for this one. I don't wanna run another hour and a half episode. <laughs> I have to record these games in bursts, because um, otherwise the footage gets, it skips a lot of frames if I try to record too much in one go. Maybe I need to upgrade my, my PC. I think Lexi wanted to speak to you. Alright, I'll go have a word with her. First, let me... Uh, Give this to Jarl. Where is he? God damn it, game. Why do you keep telling me he's... All right, he's down here. All right, let's talk to Lexi. Now yeah, she's here. We need to talk about Sam. Dr. Taparo does not approve of how we escaped to the cat containment field on the Archon's flagship. By stopping the Pathfinder's heart, no, I do not approve. Relax, Doc. It turned out okay. Dying, even temporarily, is never okay. Ryder, Sam killed you. Yes, he brought you back, but what if he didn't? I cannot learn without the Pathfinder. That would be akin to killing a part of myself. Your lines of code, you can't die. Sam would never hurt me. Thank you, Scott. <sighs> Look, I'm not against Sam. I'm not against you, Sam. But my job's hard enough without an AI stopping your heart. Even to save your life. All right. I'll find a new party trick. Have Gil teach you three card Monty or something. Lexi, I apologize for any distress I have caused you. <sighs> And I'm sorry for calling you lines of code. You're more than that, even if you don't have cells to prove it. I mean, she does have a point to be fair. But at least Sam actually asked before killing me. Where the f where are you, Jarl? Goodness sake. Game. This is why we need a remaster. To iron out these little glitches. It'll never happen, but I will keep asking for it regardless. Hey, Joel. We got the bits. Ah, huh. you acquired the components? Yes. I'm looking forward to seeing what you and Gil put together. He's very gifted. If... When we succeed, more of your people can experience our stories as they are meant to be enjoyed. Goda Tavitara. The Lulia Reborn Trilogy. I'm weeping a bit already. <laughs> that was fun. All right. Uh, back to Haval then. We talk to... Uh, Joel's real mother, and see if we can. Didn't digest it without heavy processing. Cellulolysis would be hugely inefficient. Are you still trying to figure out how to eat Helios flora? Oh shoot! I was talking out loud again, wasn't I? You're adorable, CV. Uh, right. Haval. 
if you can complete these side quests as well. Need to remember where they where they said they were. atmosphere LZ in sight Right, apparently Super U Broken bits and pieces to the left of the map and to the right of the map. Not sure where though. But first we'll head here. Well let's be lazy, why not? But fast travels there for Oh, I have to take a shuttle. Ah, maybe I can so you take me back to where the thing place. John! John! <laughs> Wait. Is that bad news? No, no. The Pathfinder is interested in where I grew up. Ryder, this is my true mother, Sahuna Amadara. Nice to meet you. I know Ingaro liked the hugging. <laughs> Giles told me how much he admires you. Really? He's my favorite. Smart, loyal, kind. A great shot. Writes poetry, souls. Mother. <laughs> I'm late for a resistance meeting. Stay clear. Your mother's in the resistance? <laughs> yes. And every child is her favorite. Everyone, this is Scott. Hi. Look who the car can drag to. Welcome back. This is where I spent most of my days growing up. Me, my sister, Guan, our cousin, Etta, and brother, Finn. Then, Bavezil, Roru. So wonderful to Ejal, have you back. A human. Jal, <laughs> you bring in someone special to meet us. Wow. Cozy. We like to live like this. Gonna give your friends some real food? Good to see you. And here's my room. My... Tiny sanctuary. You must dream of a big place of your own. Sometimes. <laughs> Maybe. Doesn't matter. This will always be my home. Oh, no. Who put this here? Schematics? Of... When I was seven, my aunt stole a cat weapon for me. So I took it apart. To learn. And that is, was, a Karkin. Pet Karkin. <laughs> Outfit. He died. So I also took him apart. To learn? Why not? <laughs> I never show people these things, but I feel like we're family. I'm glad Ephra threw you on my ship. Hey, there's one more thing you might like. Sit there. Been interesting so far.
Nice. Nice. You made that? Long ago. It's not accurate. More of a dream, really. Just one more thing I want to take apart and figure out. Me too, Jal. Me too. Oh, that was nice. All right, that's done. Right. Need to double check where these things are. Okay. It's apparently one around here. And it looks like I may have missed some. But we'll just confirm. There's six in total. I'm not sure how many I have. Doesn't look like I can get back to that bit where uh the actual mission was, which is annoying, but hey, that's life, we don't always get what we want. Whoa, hello. Here we go. Axel had more of the new aliens uh, uh, had formed an alliance with our wayward deserters and we went to see for ourselves. It was worse than we feared. There are multiple species of these new aliens, even worse. They weren't just ruling our, uh, our people, they were exalted like heroes. Everywhere I looked, cowards bowed and bargained with these disgusting things, blind to the reality that they had only traded one oppressor for another. I'll never forget what Axel told us that day. All aliens are the same in the end. They want to take what's ours and turn us into slaves. The Rokar see with clear eyes and our hearts are pure. We won't succumb to these new invaders. We are the true resistance army. And one day soon all Angara of every world will know it. Alright. Okay, I may have already got that one. Okay, going to this map, there's another one about there. If I can't get all of them, I want to make sure I, I can at least get the ones I can still get to. Check everything. 
Look for a data pad of some kind. Interesting. Ah, I missed it. How did our lives come to this? How could our ancestors let the Ket conquer our world so easily? And why do our present leaders fail to protect us now? Uh, unity destroys us from within. Our people have repeatedly failed to join forces when we needed to most. We've blamed each other, bickered and betrayed and given our conquerors easy prey. Now we see a new enemy invading our space, offering extinction disguised as hope, lies meant to divide us. It falls on those who can see past these deceptions to prevent our people from repeating the mistakes that doomed us in, doomed us in the past. All Angara must become one to have any hope of defeating the evil forces surrounding us this is the single belief of the Rokar, and I feel its truth in my blood. Our course is just. Okay, priority ops, right. That lot to do. Additional tasks. That, that's what I'm on now. Okay, we're nearly done, actually. Right, this one apparently over there. I know it's technically cheating looking up things, but I'm gonna have to use a guide when I replay the Silent Hill games to get the good endings. Anyway, so why not? Maybe that maybe that could be my thing. Not quite the completionist kind of guy, but I would like to see the true endings to some of these games. Jet. Just gonna run. Leave them to it. No, no, there's no need. Let's do this. No need. Ah, here we go. Axel confronted me in my pain and comforted me in my pain and rage. He had been a slave for the cat and barely escaped one of their camps. He understood the horrors our people had faced for decades under the enemy's occupation. He reminded me of who our people were before, how uh, how we had bent the stars to our wills. The cat had taken our greatest achievements, but they had never changed who we are. Axel told me of his of his new movement, he called it the Rokar. A name from the distant past, a group of great warriors who defended our civilization. Axel offered a chance to reclaim what the cat had taken from me. Not my loved, uh, not my loved ones, but the sense of control I'd lost with them. I would never need to feel powerless again. I listened to his voice, saw through his eyes, and believed in him. Oh, oh dear. All right, let's do that one down. Okay. Next one is the other side. Okay. 
There we go. In here, maybe? Rear car terminal. Right. Not that one. Uh, here we go. I followed Axe all across the world and we found more like us. People who had lost everything to the cat survivors, lost and hopeless. He opened their eyes the way we ha he had mine and the Rokar's ranks grew. We came to Havar to build a place where we could plan in safety and hone the skills we would need to fulfill our mission of freeing our people from oppression. We didn't realise a new enemy had already invaded strange creatures from another galaxy hiding in a canyon. Axel knew this was the sign. We were meant to find them. We sent a group to confront this threat. The invaders shouted at, us, shouted at us in a language we didn't understand and we witnessed the truth of their intentions. We saw the weapons in their hands. We showed them we had weapons of our own and they fled from our power. I think I've read this one before. It was the first time I felt happy since the last morning I saw my family alive. Alright. Next one. About there. them dealt with I haven't really explored this part actually now that I think about it and maybe the ones I'm missing are around here There we go. Alright, it's got to be around here somewhere then.
All right, I think we're good. Oh, here we go, datapad. These words have always belonged to us. From the moment our ancestors saw them through ancient telescopes, we claimed them when our first when our first explorers reached the stars, and they remained our our worlds even after the scourge divided us in darkness. Outsiders have no right to these treasures, and true Angara must stand ready to defend our birthright. This is not a matter for debate or diplomacy. The care have already shown us that everything we love will be taken from us if we don't strike back. The governor of Aya is a weak coward, and the so-called leader of the resistance has failed us by not exterminating the new aliens the moment they met them. I have scattered these memories for whoever finds them. If you are Angara, learn from my experiences and join the Rokar. If you are not, know that we will destroy you. Hey, okay. That's the manifesto's done. Unearthed. Collect unearthed remnant devices on Haval. Alright, that's the next one. Let's get this cleared up. One second. Alright. We'll start this off and then we'll close it up because we're near the end of this episode. There's one over here, so let's go and get this one done. Which direction? This way. Okay, well I'm glad we, I can actually get these done. I was worried there for a, for a moment. Ignore the uh, the local wildlife guys. We have more important things to do. I will take that though. Enemies. There we go. Okay, there's grab this one and then we'll finish this off in the next episode I think don't want to go on for another hour and a half because that video took forever to render it's like two hours mind Pathfinder, the organic life on Havaro has begun to stabilize. It appears the vault is performing biological repairs. Imagine what we'll see here in a few years. down here don't think so
around here somewhere? Might have to look into this a bit more. Ah, it's this! Historians believe much of our progress was spurred by such finds. We might benefit from collecting these artifacts. I think you're right. Okay, the next one is around here. But for now, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been sick for later. This has been Mass Effect Andromeda, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.